Hi YouTube, hi. Corby Knight recommended that I say hello to you. What do you need to change the background of your Geometry Dash game to look something cool like this? Look how neat this looks. Isn't that awesome? So today we're gonna be learning how to do it. Let's 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 show everybody how to do it. So first, make sure you have Geometry Dash installed. That's pretty that's pretty simple. Yep. Oh, Corby Knight. Yeah, figured this one out. So make sure that you have the Geode Mod Loader installed. This link and all the links uh, will be in the, the details, so you can check that out. Uh, install, there's a mod called Menu Shaders that you can find under Detail or Download. Menu Shaders. Once you get Menu Shaders installed, um, make sure that you go to the Shader Toy website. So here's a good example of the one that I'm using. The Shader Toy website has a whole bunch of cool ones. You go into browse, you can find your own. Note, not all of these are going to work. Yes. So like this one might work, that one might work. A lot of the 3D ones apparently aren't working. I found the really good one that I found was the, the kind of like neon cool looking. This one didn't work, but make sure that you go down to the bottom, grab this code, and then you're gonna end up going to another website where you end up converting this code into the proper file that you put into your resources folder, okay? Which also, again, the, stream, the Steam library resources folder will be in the description. So you paste the code, it'll give you the right output code to pop into a menu-shader-.fsh file type. You download it, you put it into your resources folder. Again, the resources folder right here, it's not as hard as it might seem. Start geometry dash back up and you'll find that, well, your main menu will be changed. What I like to do actually, final little tip for everyone that, that made it to the end of this video. When I went to my menu shaders mod and I went into the settings for the menu shaders, I selected everything other than the main menu and then I unselected main menu. That way, when I go into the levels, I'm good to go, but I can also click on the cute little icons, right? <clears throat> so many of the many of the latest members are from members, correct? All right, well if you enjoyed this 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 little how-to video, please like it or something if you liked it and maybe comment saying like, oh, I want more of these guides in the future. So bye everybody, bye on YouTube. Watch another video and catch you in the next stream. Have a happy one. Happy, happy, hap, ha enjoy your streaming. Have fun, have fun streaming. Bye. See ya.